Hello everybody and welcome back to chapter 13. So last time we had just had Amicia uh, go through this crazy nightmare of trying to get to Hugo but not being able to save Hugo and then surprisingly Hugo actually had disappeared and we find him inside of this giant cathedral where they took a bit of his blood, they were feeding the blood to rats and apparently the Grand Magistrate, the one in charge of all of the Inquisition that we've been facing, has actually been excommunicated from the church. So things aren't looking very good for them, but they're not exactly looking good for us. And we just found Mommy? Hugo's mother. Uh, Mommy? Hugo? But, but, so they... Amicia said you were dead, but you're not. Amicia... My darling, you must go if they find you here. No, I'm staying with you. Oh, Hugo, did they take your blood? Oh my God. All right, Hugo, we'll go together. But you have to find the keys. They must keep them in the room at the end of the corridor. Can you make it there? I think we can. Now, okay. I originally had thought that Beatrice Go. was in on this somehow, but apparently she is in no way in on this at all. So let's see if we can't find the keys so we can get her the hell out of here. As soon as you have the keys. I want everything prepared and ready to begin. Do you understand? Yes, Lord Nicholas. All right, you heard him. Everything will be ready. The alchemist will talk. I'm going to enjoy it. Just do your job. The captain of the guard doesn't appreciate improvisation, and neither do I. Uh, yes, of course. Let me know when you're ready. I have to meet the lead. Hmm. Right. This might get me a promotion. Authority, results. If only Mister was here. Not the room. No. Woman has a uh, I. So soft. Torturers are a whole nother breed of person. Like I couldn't imagine being part of a torturers guild, especially back then. With the captain around, the best At all. The rats. They are all afraid of rats. If I can just free them. Oh, that's for the cages. Okay. So if we go and we hit the lever, we can let the rats free. Now, since Hugo had his blood helped with Amicia's somewhat cure, does this mean that we'll now be able to walk through the rats without problems? It doesn't look like it. So... The key was over there. We had these lanterns when we were walking by. Do you think we can use the lanterns to get to the key? I think so. So if we turn this so we can get to that lantern. Then we turn this towards the key. Yeah, that's pretty disgusting. You don't want to look at those corpses. So let's grab the key and get back to Beatrice. Uh, bright light, everyone. Okay, so... I guess now we turn the light back. Now we have to get back. So if we turn the light to go back, then we should be able to turn this light to open up our passage. I think we'll have to make one more... Uh, one more light turn in order to make sure that we can actually get over here. Yeah. Those rats definitely want to kill us. I'm not sure why, though, because... I know I understand gameplay mechanics and all that, but you think that the rats would be friendly to Hugo? It's alright. Sure will hurt you now. 
My hero. How do you feel? Your head. It... it talks to me. All the time now. And what does it say? It says... it wants me to join it. The first threshold. Mommy, I'm scared. We'll never get out of here. We don't have a choice. If I am with you, the voice, are you ready to reply? Ready to reply. Like, are we going to be able to control the rats? Is Hugo going to gain some, like, superpowers? I'm not sure this is a good idea. It's, it doesn't seem like a good idea to give an eight-year-old the power to control all rats. Uh, eight-year-olds are already kind of a problem to, to hold on to. Can we, like... Oh. Move past the rats. Do we have light? We do. Um find this document and get out of here. God, we'll make him leave. Use the rats. Will they eat him? Rats. No, no. no, we don't have to worry about him eating them. Run, you big coward. You're scared, aren't you? But yeah, like eight year old this the power to be power truly yes, terrifying, I don't see the, see that as being a good That's idea at all. Poor guy. I can imagine things are going well for him at the moment. What the hell are the rats doing here? What the hell happened? Hmm. Interesting that they've made it this far because I would have thought with where we had released the rats that they really wouldn't have been able to go this far. Then again. Maybe there was a lot more access than I thought there was. Or maybe a lot more rats than I thought there was. Ooh. What do we have going on in this room? Oh, these roads are in a terrible state. How are we going to deliver this? Huh. All we need now is to lose one of these cages. Be careful. I guess we'll free some rats and take over. I think we can drive this guy away with the rats. Interesting. Yeah, the rats definitely are out in the day, even when it's not like foggy or cloudy or anything. I think it's specifically like firelight that seems to drive them away. I know we've had quite a few discussions on like what the rats are actually able to like resist and stuff, but it seems like it's specifically fire. Okay, I think we're almost out. I can't imagine there's too many more puzzles. Cause this seems to be almost too easy. Mommy, why do I know how to do this? It's, uh, it's the blood that decides. It's complicated to explain. And this place is awesome Amicia looking though. No, I'll explain later. We had nothing. Yeah, Amicia would have no right, clue. Darling. Let's get out of here, huh? Uh oh, cutscene. Yeah, yeah, I, I told you it was too easy. I bet you that. I bet you that uh, Joshua or whatever his name was, Nicholas. Nicholas, that's so, what it was. I bet you Nicholas saw you us really following him and just kind of let us go. Last. I know what you have done to him. You have taken what you wanted, now let him go. Oh, 
how you insult me, Madame de Rune. Your son is the natural carrier of the macula. And it has not yet finished with him. Which means neither have I. But this you know. Vitalis, let us finish this. Nicolas, you cannot understand. You feel it as I do. He does look healthier do than when I? we first saw him. Or at least I think so. Bound by blood now. What do you think, Hugo? Your family grows larger, huh? I beg of you. I promise to help you, but allow my son to leave. His destiny is not to be a Darun. His destiny is to be here. Ugh. At my side. I, I am not surprised. Like, he's not sure what his powers are, and he needs to make sure that Hugo sees the fulfillment of his own. Okay, well, we can control the rats. I don't see how this is going to be an issue. Unless you're trying to push us... Unless you're trying to push us to our full extent. On the other hand, you're trying to... Uh, you're trying to feed your own guards to... Fuel Hugo's powers. Oh, there he is. Yeah, so, what do you think it's going to look like if Hugo is able to control the rat tornadoes from the previous episodes? I, I, I feel as though it'd be pretty insane. Maybe that's the second stage of unlocking powers? You gain the power of Rat Tornado? Well, that was an interesting boss fight. So it was just a test. Say something. Hugo, can you hear me? Oh no. He is powerful. But he has not reached the threshold as we'd hoped. I'm surprised that they understand what these thresholds look like because they've never seen anything like this before. And they never even got to look at the book that Misia and Lucas have back at the castle. We have other pawns we can play. Take her away. <laughs> a lot more. So much more. And you will stay here with me to make sure we get it. Ugh. Do not worry. Using his mother as a pawn to keep him growing into his powers. You are truly an evil we villain, Vitalis. You're not even hiding the fact that you're not doing this for God. You're only doing this for yourself. All right, well... Thank you guys for watching chapter 14. I know I said 13 at the beginning, but it's, it looks like it was chapter 14. Uh, if you guys want to see chapter 15, I'll put that video right here as soon as it's available. Otherwise, check out these other two playlists I have on uh, Call of Cthulhu and Iris Falls. Thank you guys, and uh, make sure to like and comment. It really helps. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.